Hello there. This is the session of Lavender's Corner. I'm back. Yes, uh, Lavender's Corner tonight. We're doing a St. Louis Thursday night special. Uh, you know, in the words of uh, Mr. Paul Urban, you know, kind of get a little skin cat, bit of the bad, you know. I think we're going to the brew house, I believe. Yeah, brew house. Brought to you by Black Lavender Clothing Line. He charges about a pound, even though he's big and round. I just want everybody to remember something, you know, nothing lasts forever. Great man, Christopher Walken, always said, none of us are getting out of here alive. So while you're here, enjoy my friend. Message! Yeah, lately, uh, I mean, Paulie actually uh, been hanging around, you know, get back to our uh, old days, thingy, 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 thingies. Yeah, I'm just hanging out, man. It's fun. It's good times. Uh, so what's new, man? How's everything going? Uh, you know, everything's going good, you know, with the on the lavender side of things. Yeah? Uh, of course, you know, lavender has cutting back his drinking a lot. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Yeah, you know, got to get doing for my health a good turn. I'll tell you, man. <laughs> getting back in shape is a thing to do these days. You want the baddest bitches, you got to work out and look good. Just simple as that. Yeah. Either that or have millions of dollars. <laughs> and I don't have millions of dollars. Excuse me, why? But, uh, you know, th this session of Lavender's Corner, not really so much about all the ladies, all the drugs, all this and that. No, it's all about good friends going out, having a good time. Paulie, uh, we've been good friends for how long now? About 10 years, I think. About 10 years. And uh, let me tell you, the moment I met this guy, I didn't fucking <laughs> like him. I wanted to fucking punch him. I want to say, the first time I met you, I kind of was scared. <laughs> you should have been. I, well, you came with me like, Hey man, he just gave me a big old hug. I'm like, oh god, oh god. <laughs> all right, which way do I go? All right, yeah, you want to just go to the right. But all in all, me and Paulie became, you know, good friends on the way, and at the same time, we shut down a lot of party frat guys that's in their forties. <laughs> you know, I'm yeah. not saying any names, but they know who they are. We shut them down. We came through. We threw the parties. The girls uh, came. We threw one of the biggest. Barbecues, you know, right? That's that's right. We did. That was fun. I mean, that, that cost us what four hundred dollars in between both of 400 us. Four hundred dollars it cost us. It really did. But it was good. It was worth it. all day long barbecuing. Exactly. Everybody showed up. You know, we made it happen. You know, uh, it, was, it was your idea. Well, you came to me and said, "Dude, I want to I want to throw the biggest fucking barbecue ever," and I said, "Let's make this happen." We actually went to a butcher shop. Yeah, and we got did. Real we did. fucking food. <laughs> Sometimes it's it's okay to switch things up. You know, we throw the hotel parties. You know, we throw the casino parties. We throw you know the typical parties at the at the, at the bars like masas. You know. Oh God, masas! Hell yeah. Yeah, that, that's legendary. But this time he wanted to just kind of switch it up, have a day thing. You know, where people come out during the day, get drunk, eat for barbecue for free. Yeah, and that was that was fun. And that's all. And they can go to my Facebook page and they can see all those photographs because those are still all up. Oh, yeah. Those are still all up. And, um, you know, those, those were very, very, very good times. Very good times out there. Uh, I hope to try to do something like that again. And if everybody's still intact or everybody's still living, you know. Dude, I'll say this, though. <laughs> if we get a good listener base and we host another barbecue, I want to invite everybody to come if they can. Oh, we're going to invite all the listeners. All the listeners are going to get a free meal. Well, <laughs> you know, and I mean, they're going to get a chance to eat out of Hell's Kitchen. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the video, Welcome to Hell's Kitchen. Oh, yeah. Are you okay with this? Like, they're going to know, they're going to see you. They're going to check out the Facebook page. I don't care. You know why? Why? Because Lavender's always famous, baby. Oh, yeah. You know, Lavender's always out in the spotlight. That's good. Can't hold back Lavender. Oh, no. I got to keep on moving. Good <laughs> <Yeah, I'm sorry. laughs> <laughs> but all in all, y'all, this is pretty much about, you know, friends. But y'all know how we used to do back in the day. We're going to keep doing it and doing it and doing it well. The LA, the LA said that, right? And doing it and doing it well. Yeah. Queen. She was raised out in Brooklyn. Brooklyn. Uh, yeah. what? I want to thank y'all for listening out there. Make sure y'all tune in. In a couple of weeks, uh, Lavender will be making uh, another special come about. It's going to be secret. I'm not gonna tell. <laughs> Just catch and watch for the uh, subliminal messages. I thought this was a 
party. We're here at the brew house having a good time. We got Jody. Jody time. We got Leroy Triple L. Leroy Triple L, aka Lavender. That pizza looks really damn good. Yeah, it does good. I'm hungry. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Give me a drink. Son of a bitch. Get the haze in the hose. The Miscellaneous Podcast is the best show you can watch on any kind of platform ever invented. Had a good time. I think it was a great time. We met Dr. Who tonight. Spent way too much money on alcohol. Yes, we did. Which way you left? I don't, what the fuck are you going? We gotta where, follow Patrick now, man. Where's he at? I don't know. You gotta turn I back. I thought you knew where you were going. I know how to go back the other way, but I don't know how to go back the way he's talking about. Chappie, how much alcohol do you think you consumed tonight? Uh, I probably had about... In dollar worth. In dollar worth? Yeah. At least 50 bucks worth. Yeah, me too. I mean, most of the rest of the money was for the girl equity. Yeah. And you gotta, you gotta, you know, get the, get the ladies their drinks. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, I thought all that she matters. was gonna go home with Tic Tac, man. No, no, no. No, Tic Tac's... He's not getting laid. Dude, he just... Fucking, dude, they're all over each other. And then Tic Tac's gonna go home, go to sleep, probably beat his meat for two minutes, and then not finish and realize he's tired. And just gonna just lay out. <laughs> this has been fun night, man. Lead us out with some music. We should have done the karaoke, dude. We should have, but you know. If you like what you heard, please subscribe to the Miscellaneous Podcast. Please, 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 please.